Good morning, saints. Please stand for prayer. Today is the feast of St. Isabel of France. St. Isabel, please pray for all of us, especially for those ce celebrating a birthday today. Happy birthday today to Ella Douglas, Christopher Glenn, and Sienna Isabel. Let us pray. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord God, judge of the earth, have pity on us poor souls who, even knowing of our eternal home with you in heaven, still choose sin time and time again. Have mercy on us, for the spirit is willing, but the flesh is weak. Together we pray. Heavenly Father, we praise you and give you thanks for the blessings you have bestowed upon us. Keep us accordant with truth and active in charity as exemplified by our patron, St. Thomas Aquinas. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please join me as we honor our flag and country. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have a great day, saints. Good, Good afternoon, afternoon Saints. Saints. Welcome, Welcome back, back to, to the Halo, Halo Midday, Midday Show. Show. Today is Friday, February 26, 2021. The Saint of the Day is Saint Isabel of France. A princess of France, she refused offers of marriage from several noble suitors to continue her life of virginity consecrated to God. She ministered to the sick and the poor, and after death of her mother, founded the Franciscan Monastery of the Humility of the Blessed Virgin Mary at Longchamps in Paris. There will be a Halo meeting Tuesday, March 2nd during STA in the Journalism Room 216. Anyone interested in announcing with us in the CYO Showdown, creating stories, or commentating other sport, sports should stop by. All are welcome. Brackets for the CYO Showdown were passed out today during STA period. If you would like to join the contest for a chance to win an $100 gift card, please get your entries and $3 entry feed to Michael Payne or Andrew Abadir via Venmo. Brackets can also be filled out at sdahalo.net slash CYO showdown. Thanks. There is a new music class offer next year. SDA is bringing back their strings class. If you play an orchestral string instrument, please, sure, please be sure to enroll in this class. If you have any questions, reach out to Mr. Heidish by email or stop by the music room at any time. If you are interested in trying out for the boys tennis team, it is not too late. Try out start on Monday, March 1st. Please contact coach John Seal for information at netjts at yahoo.com. Now to Kelsey with her final thoughts about Black History Month. Hello Saints, I'm Kelsey and as we wrap up Black History Month, let us all take a moment of silence because as you may have not known, today is the anniversary of Trayvon Martin's death and marks nine years since he was shot while he was walking home. Even when Black History Month is over, I implore you to, to truly think about the impact of recent events in today's climate and that nobody, and I seriously mean nobody, should ever be condemned for something that they cannot change, as obvious as that may sound. People who refuse to acknowledge the adversities that a person of color has to face in this country today are exactly why we are still dealing with the issues that we have today. Stereotypes, microaggressions, and the long list of false pretenses given to people of color just because of something as trivial as skin color is something that is very much alive, in whether it be 2021 or 2001, whether you choose to live with rose-colored glasses or not. So please, as a communion of saints, celebrate the lives of those who cannot be here today and use the voice that God has given you in all different types of ways and across all platforms. Don't just say Trayvon's name, but say all their names. Thank you. On the menu today in the Saints Cafe, lasagna rolls, Bosco's, and broccoli. Students, remember, you must have money on your account to buy lunch. Please check your balance and add money if your account is low or overdrawn. Thanks from the Saints Cafe staff. If you're trying out for a spring sport and have not turned in your physical and concussion forms, please do so today. You will not be allowed to play, practice, or participate if you do not have these important forms turned into the athletic office. Spring sports include girls swim and dive, softball, baseball, girls soccer, boys golf, boys tennis, and track. If you're planning to join the track and field team this season, signups are on the team website, and the first practice is Monday at 3.30 in the theater. Email Coach Wrigley if you have any questions. Coaches, please look on our website for a list of student physicals turned in to see if all of your athletes are listed. 
If they are not on our list, we do not have their physical. Now it's time for our fun feed fact of the day. Did you know that the longest toenails ever recorded belongs to Californian Louise Hollis, who has managed to grow and maintain toenails that are approximately six inches long? What? I did not know that. Oh my goodness, those are some long toenails. Thanks for watching today's Midday Show. We'll be back with more for you next week. I'm Elizabeth. And I'm Tim. Don't, Don't forget, forget, we'll find a way to make, make today, today great. great.